cover uh, strength and weakness of sword. I will cover opportunity and threat. Then I can talk about fun to Hunga yeah. yeah, and with that we'll wind up. I focused on the technology aspects of the presentation and uh, Priyanka focused on the soft aspects of the presentation and how to boost uh, the traffic to Hangama.com from the perspective of a real user. Welcome back. Now, as you're probably aware, on every episode, one business leader comes in, sets a task and judges who will be pitched in or pitched out out of our contestants. But this week, we have three judges. Our business leader for today's episode, Neeraj Roy, has requested his two COOs, Albert Almeida, CEO of Hangama Mobiles, and Siddharth Roy, CEO of Hangama Consumers, welcome gentlemen, to come in and help him in the judging process. So, before we start, Tony, you have the privilege yet again of uh, telling us which team gets to go first. I'll have Aparna's team, the lady, first. So, Aparna and Rajiv, you're on. We're going to begin our presentation with the SWOT. Talking about strengths, we feel that excellent content in terms of quality and quantity combined with a superb distribution channel is uh, going to be your biggest strength. Having said that, we also realized that there is a gap when it comes to television content. Secondly, there was a very little user-generated content that we uh, came across. This is again something that can uh, build engagement and both these points open up scope for uh, great opportunities which Raji will touch upon. 120 million active internet users on mobile and growing very rapidly has created massive opportunity for data services. Utility services like education, healthcare, agriculture, information is a possible opportunity. Now let me go to threat. Piracy and free content availability continues to be a threat. We understand market innovation like this. Uh, a. Understanding unique consumer needs. B. Creating unique offerings for those unique consumer needs. And C. Ability to deliver those offerings in a satisfying manner to end consumer. We are proposing number one, streaming of movies and music on 3G, 4G wireless devices. Live streaming of music concerts is another possibility that we are recommending in long run, maybe in year three, get into sports live streaming and sport based entertainment. Utility services, education, content aggregation and distribution on mobile devices, healthcare and rural information content oriented apps. On community and social networking apps, we are recommending at least have one leading app which makes you leader in this space and we are recommending acquire a company called SMS Kapshap or any other equivalent. As far as mobile uh, payment and mobile payment solutions are concerned, we are recommending that you please stay, stay away from from that. 60 seconds uh, to your 6 minute. Next we come to distribution where uh, we are saying move from on deck to off deck and we are recommending that split the big Hangama um, app into smaller niche apps which can be sold through various platforms. Other options that we are recommending are uh, one, uh, retailing through physical outlet channels such as uh, crosswords and mobile uh, handsets are sold and also leveraging subscriptions of uh, entertainment magazines or children's magazine. You can have bundled subscription offers and... Uh, Thank uh, you. Your two minutes starts now. I run an uh, online store called thegreenandgoodstore.com that sells eco-friendly products. We will build games together around the theme of environment and how people's actions can uh, impact environments. So um, you can have a, a, a game where people make consumer choices, buy products and change their lifestyles, their communities, take decisions for the planet and while doing or making these choices, they reduce carbon and earn points. Now these points can also be redeemed on greenandgoodstore.com where we actually have the products that people have chosen to decrease their carbon footprints. So not only do people get educated about uh, a really important issue in a very fun and entertaining way, but uh, we also work together and uh, take a step together for uh, uh, solving a crisis uh, that's really looming in front of all of us, the climate crisis. So now let me talk about Funtoot, which is my company and product. Funtoot is world's first intelligent personal tutor in K-12 education space. So what we are recommending, uh, integration of Hangama games into Funtoot rewarding system. The co-development of education games, we are also saying that critical lessons can be taken by celebrities, for example, poetry by Big B and English by Rakul. We are finally, what I would like to say is, each child is very unique. Let us help each one of them to succeed. Hangama's reach and entertainment content and Funtoot's intelligence and education content can create a big impact in education. Thank you. Um, it's question time. You'll have 30 seconds to answer your question. Question is simple. You've 
talked about areas that we can participate in, but you've not necessarily given any sense of pricing. Was there any thought that you all gave understanding the market environment right now, that what kind of pricing could we do for introduction of newer services that you've talked about? Each service will be at a different price. Funtoot right now is being sold to each child in grade two to grade eight segment at 300 rupees per month, per subject. And we have validated it, we have been selling it for our six months. So it is working absolutely fine. So the way we have partnered with a PC service provider, same way there can be partnership here, wherein a RAV share can be done. So that's the final you know, you know, consumer price. So each service needs to be analyzed for, for pricing differently. I just gave an example of education service. So both of you took gaming as a form of gratification. A, what was the reason for that? And why not the entire plethora of, of, of a suite of entertainment products that we have across the board. The reason why we picked gaming, it really targets the youth, that is uh, your target market. So we need a medium which is engaging, fun, and people can see a reward at the end of it for actually making that impact. So I guess that is something that was common for both of us and uh, it you know, converts an untangible, intangible outcome into a very tangible thing. So people can relate to it and make that impact and change. Thank you. Shirang, Priyanka, your time starts now. Uh, to begin with, uh, we have done a SWOT analysis. Hangama is already a leader in uh, mobile entertainment and value-added services. It already has an extensive reach because it has consumers in over about 46 countries with 150 partners all across the world. We thought there is a lack of segmented targeting and service personalization out here. Also, there is a lot of content that is available on the website, but users find it a little difficulty when it comes to finding the content. You can target new audience that would be a business sector or an education sector. The threats that we see is basically from the international market, Plus, we believe that piracy and free downloads is the biggest threat that you have. What is the big idea to take uh, Hangama forward? So the first big idea that we thought was content access devices. So mobile phones and mobile devices are not, no longer voice devices. So they are portals to create, consume and share data. So why don't you create, co-brand your own devices with Hangama so prominently that it has entire access to the Hangama data network. Next big uh, idea is display adaptive content. So uh, basically what we have seen in the last two years is uh, ubiquitous uh, uh, smart displays varying from very small to very big. So uh, just don't serve the same content to everybody, just uh, customize the content based on uh, who requires. So uh, 4G comes with a huge range of uh, services, uh, especially for uh, content distribution. There are something like IMS core network where you route your multimedia content and the technology aware applications. When you put your Hangama apps on your tablets or phones, make them aware of the underlying technology that there's a 4G, Wi-Fi or a 3G and uh, enhance the experience based on that. Taking the promotional activity. 60 seconds left for your six minutes. You can tie up with uh, airlines where uh, the flyers can create their own playlist for their journeys. How can you increase the user penetration? Is you can create small mobile series, mini series or sitcoms, or maybe even comic strips. People living in the rural areas, they find it difficult to visit the religious places. So you can give them live darshan of Shirdi, Vaishnav Devi on their mobile phones. Thank you. I'm going to have to force you now, unfortunately, your six minutes up, to move to how your respective business ideas would mutually benefit Hangama and yourselves. Your time starts now. Uh, IKT can leverage on Hangama's uh, social platform and vice versa. And we can create farmers' communities, which can be individuals, corporates, uh, also housewives. So out here, Hangama gets a new target audience. Also, what we can tie up with Hangama and where my users can download the recipes, which uh, the crops are already grown on their house, so they can download recipes from there, nutritional tips, maintenance type tables, or how to take, take care of the crops out there. Also, we can host apps on your website, which can be downloaded by the users at a later stage, uh, which teaches them how they can grow the crops in an easy manner and basically maintain them. Uh, United Mobile, we create uh, three main products. Uh, uh, Usync is uh, actually an award-winning uh, MBAS platform. So what it does is uh, you can bundle cloud storage. So when people download stuff, put it in the cloud and they can stream it or view it from individual devices. We have a Uconnect and Umanage technologies, which are actually gateways to 4G technologies and IMS networks. So you have 30 seconds. So um, with Umanage, what you can do is once you put your devices out, uh, you can manage the devices and also manage the services. So a combination of using Q-Connect, Q-Manage is a strong MWAS platform with built-in billing and uh, data functionalities and sync functionalities. So you can roll out a wide range of services. 
Perfect. You uh, actually finished the photo finish with the two minutes. My question is uh, pertaining to, you know, this entire service that you are proposing, which is U-Sync. Give me in 15 seconds how Hangama service can be linked into this. U-Sync offers a data sync solution. Somebody downloads a song or a movie in one of his devices, just like an iCloud for non-i devices. It is available across multiple uh, devices based on the user account control management. And what would be the pricing for that? Right now, for uh, a very limited phone book uh, capabilities, we charge like 199 rupees a year. So it's extremely cheap. Okay. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you so much. So, Tony, who, in your opinion, are the weaker teammates on each team? It's a very rhetorical question and uh, I wouldn't want to be a judge of that because I was actually two times the weakest candidate. So I would refrain from actually being a judge because I don't have the competence to understand your business and the strengths of these people. I would have looked for a little more than the diplomacy that you sort of demonstrated there right now. Over one hour or two hours of your time, you are asking people which took your company four and a half years to figure out, right? And then you're asking me, another contestant with them, to make a decision on futures. I don't think it's fair. Thank you, Tony. We are at that point in the show, minutes away from saying goodbye to one of our five contestants. It's the part that I've never made a secret of. I absolutely dread, but it has to be done. All of that will happen after this break. Unfortunately, uh, you would have to be our candidate who gets pitched out. And now for the Samsung Galaxy Tab 750 contest. What is the pixel density of Samsung Galaxy Tab 750? A. 132 pixel per inch. B. 149 pixel per inch. C. 169 pixel per inch. To send in your answers, type pitch, space, question number, space, A, B or C at 5995 or email us at the pitch at BloombergUTV.com. One lucky winner who can answer the maximum number of correct answers gets to win a Samsung Galaxy Tab 750 at the end of the series.